up, it's Yanisa, and welcome to the very first episode of Ukulele Land, where I teach you all things ukulele. The way that I'm gonna do this is I'm going to make content based on what you ask for. Something that a lot of you have been asking for for a really long time is to make a tutorial or to tell you the chords for my original song, Fly Away Free Bird. You're free. This song is really special to me. It's one of my favorite ones that I've ever written. So thank you so much for requesting this tutorial. I'm super excited to teach it to you. So let's get started. First thing you need to do, of course, is grab your ukulele and I'm using a tenor size ukulele, but you can use a soprano or concert and it'll be the exact same thing. Before we get into the chords, there are some key things that you need to know. These little rectangles are called frets. So this is the first fret, second fret, third, fourth, and all the way to the other side. The strings are also numbered. So this is the first string, second string, third, and fourth. And your fingers also have their own numbers. So this is the first finger, second finger, third, and fourth. And the thumb doesn't get a number. Sorry, dude, that's okay. The first chord you need for Fly Away Free Bird is G major seven. The way you play is you take your first finger and you're going to play the first, second, and third string all with your first finger like this. The next chord you need is E minor seven. The way you play E minor seven is you put your first finger on the second fret, third string, and your second finger on the first string, second fret. The third chord you need is an A minor. This is one of the easiest chords. So you're gonna take your second finger and put it on the second fret, fourth string. The last chord you need is C minor. And just like G major seven, you're going to be playing the first, second, and third string, but instead you're going to be on the third fret right here. So G major seven is on the second fret and C minor is on the third fret. The cool thing about this song, I made it super easy for you, you're welcome. It's the same four chords over and over again for the entire thing. So while some of these chords are a little complicated, once you have them down, you just play them over and over and over again for like three minutes and you've played the whole song. So now let's go over the strumming pattern. Down, stop, up, up, down, up, down, stop. So when you add that together with the chords, it sounds like this. So now let's go over the strumming and the chords all together with the verse of the song. So like I said, you play the same four chords over and over again, but I'm gonna start with the verse so that you know what the feel is and then you can just continue playing until the end of the song. And there's one little part that I wanna make sure to tell you what the timing is for, okay? So stay tuned. Get ready with your G major seven. One, two, three, and I will wake up having a good day. Sun will shine and I got good news in Now the one little part that I wanted to let you know about is at the end of the pre-chorus, you stay on that C minor chord for a little bit longer. So it goes like this. Tuck us, roll down the street, the glass spoke to me, and this is what they said. Again. You're a free bird. Does that make sense? I hope so. <laughs> Let's play along with the chorus just so you can hear what that sounds like. One, two, three, and down, stop, up, up, down, down. You're a free bird, your life is your life. And if you wanna fly away, then go ahead and fly. You're a free bird, your mind is your mind. And if you wanna fly away, then go and do
All right, so I hope that tutorial was helpful for you. Thank you again for requesting it and leave me a comment down below if you have any questions and definitely let me know what you want to see next on Ukulele Land. Okay, goodbye.